Hi Cancer, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading, Cancer, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading, Cancer. Yes, at the bottom of the deck, we have the Three of Cups, and this is Water Energy, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio Energy. So this is a card of celebrations. This is a card of socializing, um, having good times with friends, family, loved ones. Uh, there could be some good news that you could be celebrating. This can also be an energy of a reunion, reconnecting with someone, and uh, being in high spirits. So let's see what the rest of the cards have to say. Okay, we have the Chariot, Cancer Energy, the Four of Wands, Fire Energy, and we have the Queen of Wands, Fire Energy. So it looks like there is some sort of positive news around a relationship. There's some sort of milestone that has been achieved, and it could be that friends, family, loved ones are coming together to celebrate this union, because we do have the Four of Wands and the Three of Cups. So there's this feeling of stability, security, and knowing where you stand with someone and being in a good place overall in your relationship. Um, this 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 feeling of progress uh forward movements with the chariot and even a victory success you and someone are finally on the same page and you're moving forward together you know in a harmonious way this is someone who's very drawn towards you very attracted to you they see you as very desirable with the queen of wands um, and you are being elevated you could be getting a lot of attention right now um you know not only from this person but also from friends families loved ones it looks like you're very attractive at this time and there's this feeling of being made to feel special and um really being admired so let's clarify these cards cancer Okay, so we have the Seven of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. So a card of investment, a card of security, long-term um, consistency. So it does look like something you've invested in is paying off. You're, you're, you're at that point where you're seeing something finally take off. It's been a long time coming. It could have been a very slow progression for this connection, but there's this feeling of achieving a goal, you know, even if it took a while to get here. Um, someone is showing you that they're they're genuinely invested. There's a grounded, solid, solid, reliable energy here. Okay, so let's see. We have the Three of Wands, Fire Energy, the King of Pentacles, Earth Energy, and we have the Page of Pentacles, Earth Energy. So a new beginning for this relationship. We have a card of stability and someone who's serious about you with the, the King of Pentacles. So they are investing in this. Um, there is something here about uh, laying roots, uh, stabilizing, securing this relationship. Um, and with the Three of Wands, you're seeing growth and expansion for this connection. There could have been distance involved and it's like finally you and someone can finally be together um, in, in a more practical way. Um, there could be uh, an energy of overcoming obstacles and challenges to securing this relationship. And with the Page of Pentacles, we're seeing again that opportunity being created. Someone is proving to you that they are conscientious, that they are 
they are prioritizing this connection and that they are very invested here. So some sort of practical, tangible efforts are being made and it's like this person is really showing you through their actions, through their commitment, their dedication. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an oracle card for you, Cancer. Okay, we have the end of the tough cycle approaches so you could have had to wait for this person uh there could have been something in the way maybe it, it was distance for some but it could be anything there's an energy of overcoming obstacles being at the end of that tough cycle um this person is really able to prove to you to show you that they are invested in a very practical way okay so let's see So we have you deserve love you are lovable okay so i'm gonna put another card for you Okay, we have first emotions of love love is the magician that pulls man out of his own hat so there's definitely an energy of maturing here um being very practical when it comes to this connection also being realistic and continuing to nurture this connection despite uh you know challenges or obstacles okay so i'm gonna pull out a card for your advice uh cancer Okay, we have surrender to spirit once you've done everything you can to achieve a goal turn the situation over to the divine let spirit work its magic for you okay so that's what i'm seeing for you um cancer i hope you have a really really good day cancer bye cancer